One of the reasons the medical industry is interested in origami is to create devices that are smaller. And they wanted a new concept, not just a smaller device, but a new way to think about the devices. Origami is often useful in medicine for much the same reason that it's useful in space. If you have something that is flat and sheet-like, but you want to get it into the body, you want it to go in through as small a hole as possible. So doctors are always looking for some kind of way to be less invasive or to be more precise or perhaps to do surgeries that require more precision, maybe working with nerves or something that is very small. BYU has recently entered into an agreement with Intuitive Surgical Incorporated to license patents on devices that have been developed in our lab. Intuitive Surgical is a company that makes the Da Vinci robot that does surgeries robotically. Here we can see one of their current devices that's used to grasp things or to hold a needle to do suturing. The initial inspiration for the grasping device we worked on was an origami pattern that people commonly call chompers. Here is a large scale prototype that was based on some origami ideas of reducing the part count. So you can see that here we, we just have this 3D printed plastic uh, and here we've actually moved to uh, 3D printed stainless steel and we were able to make the parts at this four millimeter scale. 3D printing allows us to experiment with a shape or prototype very quickly. I can have uh, an idea from the computer to the 3D printer and into our lab for a look in less than a day. We have about a third or a fourth of the number of parts of a current device. So many fewer parts, and the parts we have, the complexity of the parts is lower. Our big idea is that we can make things smaller and smaller by using inspiration of things like origami that are very simple. So instead of trying to make that complexity smaller and smaller, we're going for simplicity early these uh, new devices that we've created to enable robotic surgery at smaller scales and to be less invasive, we really feel like are going to make a big difference.